you guys. Baby Nia is chewing on her butterfly and playing with it. And she's also got this toy here. This cute little toy. She's actually having playtime um, before bed. I got a request to do a um, how to powder silicone. So I figured I'd just do a night routine because she needs to get ready for bed. She's still in her adorable outfit. But she's been playing because it helps her wind down for bed. So I give her a bunch of toys and play with her. And this one's cool because she likes that. That keeps her entertained. She got that from her. And Katie. So she's excited about that. And she's been playing for a little while. She's kicking her feet. So I'm going to move her over and start getting her ready for bed. Baby Naya is not wanting to give up her toys, so I think she's, yep, she grabbed onto them and brought them with her. So she likes staying down too. She gets to move around a little bit easier than in her, in her little bouncer bed. <laughs> Alright, so Auntie adjusts her in this when Auntie was visiting. Reborn connection stuff. Ooh, you see the butterfly? <laughs> I'm gonna put those away. And she just has her night things out and um, help her calm down, took the toys away from her. And so she's just calming herself um, and just watching what I'm doing. So I have the diaper here and other stuff. That is all ready for bed. Take her little socks off. Give her a little massage. Make all her um, her body and muscles relax. Actually, do that when put her powder on, which I left up here. Max is guarding it for us. I'm gonna put the lavender because it's a comforting for nighttime. So she'll get that scent reminder that, um, oh, you got powder on your cute little bottoms. Remind her that that smell is what she smells before bed. Kind of get her senses used to that. Need to brush your hair, maybe. <laughs> She's so cute. Look at she's so little. Her diaper's coming off. I love that belly. Okay, watch her ears. I messed up your hair again. I might have to actually brush it tonight. I don't brush it too often because it's silicone. Um, it is not easily able to root the hair in there. So it can come out if you brush it. And like hers has come out from past owner a little bit. So I haven't brushed her hair too much. I'm going to put it in this little, um, this really soft pampers. He's a swaddler. It's got good um, protection for overnight, and it's really soft, so she'll be comfy in it. Um, actually, gonna put that on her after she gets powdered. So, I had the request. I can't remember the person's name. I was gonna say it. I'm sorry, but. I forgot to look right before I did the video, so. I don't use a brush, but a dirt a brush is pretty useful. Um, I don't use a brush because my 
cats are being crazy. Because the brush started um, losing fluff, so um, I just use my hands now. And I put this blanket, because um, it gets everywhere. And I'll try to like spread it evenly at first. Especially on her, because she's dark skin, um, it is harder to rub in. Oh, but I can't remember if I said the reason yet. The reason why you powder silicone is, you want your dolly? Is because it keeps it soft and helps clothes go on smooth. It keeps the skin soft and everything helps clothes go on smoothly. And I know somebody's going to ask in this video, what's wrong with their skin? She was painted as a dark skinned baby. But, um, as you can see, it's come a um, light in some areas. And that's all the questions I want to answer about that for this video. So, yeah. It's just because I get those questions all the time. So, it's no fun answering those over and over. Sounds like skin. <laughs> so cute. You look like you were playing in it. Were you playing? Playing in the powder? She's like, yeah, I want to grab that bottle right now. If only I could work my hands better, I would grab a hold of that and spill that bottle everywhere. I'm getting her armpits. She's trying. Trying to get that bottle. She's got an armature in her arms. For those that are new to my channel. So you can bend them. And they'll stay that way pretty much. It's not like all the way through, so like this part's still wobbly, but it's through her arms. So it's interesting. I like it sometimes, and sometimes I don't like it. It just depends on what effect you're going for. Whether you're just going for a picture or for realism and movement. See, she's so soft. I wish you could feel her. Silicone's amazing. I love how this is like a lot more solid and this is squishy. I don't know if that's just because it's skinnier. But anyway, she's getting ready for bed. It relaxes her to get a massage before bed, so it works out that she needs silicone. What's in your mouth? No powder taste gross. I'm just checking for teeth. No teeth yet. Still all gum, so she can't bite me. And when you do this, you can feel the spots that have been... Ooh, gotta be careful with these long nails. Um, you can feel the spots that have been covered and what ones haven't. And I don't like to put a lot on her face because it is really hard to rub in. And her face doesn't get touched as much as her body. Powder myself as well, huh, baby? It's in all our little creases, on our fat rolls, on our thighs. Are you almost ready to be dressed? You feel so soft. Babies like to be naked. It's comfy. They're like, that's how I came out, and that's how I was in the womb for nine months. <laughs> Let me grab a hairbrush and some hair stuff. My Maya kitty is watching up there. You can't see her shadow, but she's watching. I have this honest conditioning mist. It is 
sweet orange vanilla. It smells amazing. Oh, amazing. And um, as you can see, like, from the last time I brushed her, which was a really, really long time ago, there's still some hair in the brush. So, can you sit up? Don't pee on nothing, okay? Look at that belly. It's just so cute. <laughs> Tell she's eating a lot of good food. She likes to sit up when I help her because she can't do it on her own. See, even her head's still heavy for her. <laughs> Cute. Now, I like to use a, a comb instead of a brush, actually. I think I said a brush earlier. Um, because I feel like it actually gets through all the hair. I don't feel like a brush. I feel like a brush just kind of gets the top. I don't know. I don't know if that's just me. I'm not going to put a whole lot of... I'm not going to get it soaked. I'm trying not to pull and try to get the knots out at the end first. And some of our little hairs are longer. Because the silicone is like rooted in deep then when you brush it, you know, it comes out longer, so she needs a little bit of a haircut. really keep an eye on her head. She likes to try to look at other things, but she can't support it yet. Look how pretty your hair looks when it's brushed. Should try to get the back of your hair even though you're going to sleep on it tonight. It kind of has somewhat of a swirl going on. Can't exactly tell where. Kind of like babies get that bald spot when they lay on the back of their head a lot. Let's see what she's got going on. And I do like a comb over. <laughs> there we go. There, it's nice and shiny. It smells so good for bed. So cute. Try to get it like not so flat. Alright, let's put diaper on before you pee all over the place. Well, she's starting to get a little cranky, so I'm gonna give her her passy, which is glow in the dark. So if she spits it out then uh, we'll be able to find it in the dark. She's been weird with pacifiers lately. She's like sticking them out. What are you doing that for? Silly girl. You're too young to give up the passy. There we go. <laughs> Powder on, so I didn't need to put any more on her diaper. She looks pretty comfy now. Put your arms out and stretch. Oh, that's a good stretch. Feel that on your muscles? My belly button's so low. It'd be cute to see her belly button. I don't know if I can do that. Somebody sent us this diaper. It's very sweet of them. Hey, cutie. This diaper goes way up in the back. 
but I think that's good because they have a blowout Alexa room. Isn't that weird? It goes up like so far in the back. You see, this isn't like that's weird. I guess because it's cut out. Interesting. It looks so cute. It's here in her belly button. Alrighty. So it's pretty warm here. Um, I have a singlet for her. It's from Australia. We actually don't have these in the U.S. Like, not like these. They kind of look like wife beaters. <laughs> um, I've never seen these for babies here in the U.S. And I think the tag's actually on the outside. Because I tried to do it the other way, and it looks like the seam is made so that that's actually the outside. Which would make sense, because it feels better on the baby, but looks weird that the tag's on the outside, so. Not sure. Somebody from Australia can correct me. I'm wrong. Well, she's just gonna wear the singlet and the diaper to bed because it's warm, but she'll still wear a little something. Oh, Maya! You didn't make it all the way over, but you brought your ball baby! I'm gonna get her ball. When I went to get her ball, I've knocked over the powder everywhere. She hasn't played fetch in a really long time, so I definitely want to encourage that. And that entertains kid baby to see the kitty. You didn't bring it far enough, Maya. I can't go get it every time. And where in the world is your collar? Like, the, I saw her today, and there's no collar on her. <laughs> she hasn't been anywhere, so it's somewhere in the house, but I haven't run into it yet. I'm guessing either Max pinned her down and got caught on something. I don't really know. So. And I got these little booties for her. I know, it's kind of a weird outfit. Because booties with nothing, but... Hi, Maya. You didn't bring the ball far enough. Can you please bring it further? She got these booties from Auntie Natalie. Little knitted booties are so cute. They're gonna swallow your feet, aren't they? they? Might have to be for baby Melissa. I think they're gonna have to be for baby Melissa. Cause look, they're a little big. Open one, baby Melissa. Might be too hot for those anyway. Okay. Okay. So now I'm putting Maya in her bed. You can get comfy. Maya, why did you put it so far away? I'll get it in a minute. Look at that belly, it's just too cute. And she gets her bottle before bed. Let's see if you can have some more room to lay down. Your legs are kind of bunched up there. hair off. There you go. Okay, and she likes to sleep with her little baby. It's such a cute video I have of her getting her first dolly. So cute. And I'm gonna give her her bottle and she'll be ready for bed. I'll look at her right here. Are you all done?
We need a few pats on the back. She's getting sleepy. She likes her passy. She likes to fall asleep with her passy. And her little baby. We hope you enjoyed our night routine. Baby and I will be fast asleep very soon.